What is up? Making myself into a celebrity. You read the title. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you. I'm doing my makeup today to transform myself into celebrities I've been told that I look like. I'm gonna put on like similar outfits and try and recreate some photos that I found of them on the internet. Also, almost every one of them has red hair. That's cheating. So like every single one of them have curled hair, so I'm just gonna curl it. Boom. So I think I'm gonna do Elle Fanning and Amy Adams as the first two, cause it's the most basic. We just have like the light eyeshadow and kind of like feathered brows. So I'm gonna do those first. Foundation and concealer are done. It's gonna be the basic same thing for all of them. So I just figured I'd do that first. And I should probably set this before I move any further. And it starts to crack. Here we go. She just has a really subtle bronzy look. I'm gonna use bronzer for that. And then just like a tiny little wing. So I'm gonna do that. Tiny wing, wonderful tiny wing. Anyway, okay. Yes. What's he doing? Filming. What do you want? I love you. I wanted to see you. You're so pretty. Thank you. Look pretty good to me. I'm not gonna lie. Pretty impressed with myself. I need to brush this off my face. <laughs> I'm gonna add some more dimension back into my face, that's for sure. Put way too much powder. Wow, that took forever. I don't have a yellow tank top like she has, so I'm gonna use a yellow shirt and just take some pictures. As you can see, my posing isn't exactly the way hers was and the lighting's a little different. I couldn't make it exact, but I did the best that I could and tried to make my hair a similar color to hers. So this is how it turned out. And I say it's not too bad. She could use some tattoos though. Nice smile. That was about as good as I could get with that one. So we're gonna move on to, I think, Amy Adams I'm doing next. And she basically has the same makeup I'm wearing now. So I might do like more purple eyeshadow look I think she has, so we gonna see. So she is wearing highlight and she is wearing a gloss. So I'm gonna add those to the look that I'm wearing right now and then see what comes out the other end. I have on a gloss, changed up the look, hardly any, and we're gonna find a graphic t-shirt, I think is what she's wearing. The only similar graphic t-shirt I have is this Disney one, since dry is not an option, so that's what we got. <laughs> got more of a side thing going on. Here we go. This one I think was a little harder than the other one because I don't really see any major similarities in the two of us other than like our hair color is similar and like our eyes and maybe our skin tone. But as far as major facial features, I don't really see any similarities. So Nick is using my car for work and his car is dirty. Perfect, kidding, okay, here we go. I think this one turned out the best from today. Obviously it's not perfect and I changed my eye color in an app so that it would look more like her and I think it turned out pretty well. So I don't have pants, I have shorts, my mirror is exposing me, but it's impossible with curled hair. But no, I see the resemblance, it's the red hair. But other than that, I don't really see it. I am digging the look though, so this might be a new go-to for me, no I'm saying. So overall, I think I did pretty darn well with this. I know I don't look exactly like them, but I tried to um, pose as similarly as I could, which I know I also didn't do very good at, but that's okay. I thought this was fun. Um, I realized when I was editing the pictures that I totally forgot to do Emma Stone. People also say I look like her. I'll put a picture right here and you can just decide for yourself what you think. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.